hello everyone good day welcome to my channel welcome to GS global consult youtube channel so guys in today's video i want to be giving you guys a hint on what you should know while you are creating a foreign paypal account these things are what you should always have the knowledge about while creating a paypal especially if you are creating a foreign account for especially for example some nigerians creating lesotho south africa urae and uar united Emirates paypal accounts the things you should always have the idea on by creating this account so guys my name is richard for those that don't know and those that wants to know my name is richard so in this channel i give hints on what you should always work on to make it as a successful online entrepreneur so as an online entrepreneur i give hints on how you can create a stable online based business to make it successfully as a big online tap you know so guys and if you know you are new to my channel please show some like by clicking on the like button subscribing to my channel and being a member of my community because being a member of my community you are going to benefit a lot on different ideology which i believe you will also need to make it big as an online entrepreneur so guys in this video as i've said it's just going to be a guidelines on what you should do by creating a foreign paypal account so see you in the video and please don't forget to share by the way apologies for those that have been complaining that i've not been posting on a daily basis don't worry i'm assuring you guys this week is going to be a best week for me because i'm somehow free from lectures and i'm having a break off for now so in this week i believe i'll be dropping video back to back so i want you guys to stay tuned to this channel so the moment i'll be dropping more videos you will not be missing out and you'll always be the first to get the idea and start working on them so guys see you in the video Welcome to the video. So as I've said, just need to just calm down. If you, if possible, grab a chill drink, relax, and watch me as I'm saying all this. And also, please, I need you to also start jotting things down because most of the ideas which I'll be giving now are going to be of good benefit in order for you to create an account that can always overcome PayPal banning it in future. Because my most pain situation is whenever you try making it look like a balanced try making it as an online entrepreneur some criteria from the board members and the officials which you use are giving you problems to stop your business from going on for instance you start receiving payment from paypal and suddenly a news comes up and say sorry you can no longer use this what are you expecting such persons to do so this is why i just want to switch out this best time of mine to lecture you guys on this course like this course should be part of my paid course because these are part of what I teach my students that paid me in order to help them create a perfect working PayPal account. So I will be giving it to you guys just free of charge because I believe I'm also helping the community by bringing and giving out my knowledge. So number one on my list is whenever you are creating a PayPal account, please and please, you, all, you have to always be country specific because PayPal only helps according to the regional account according to regional account let me put it that way because if you create a nigerian paypal account and you have a problem in future with that account you can only meet a nigerian customer service to help you because a situation might come and you know that this account you created is not a nigerian and you are claiming that you're nigerian how they can how can they help you don't believe that this person is trying to fraud or trying to do some some annoying stuff like that so i always advise you should always be country specific in terms of creating an account but i always i always want people to understand this those that are be saying that it's better for them to create a u.s paypal account to create a foreign uk paypal account though it is a good idea even those that are creating canada paypal accounts come to think of it the only thing i always want you guys to understand is all those accounts are good because you have to benefit more than those in africa using that same account like a u.s account you benefit more because many criteria that are there is you can receive font you can send font you can even ask for donation just show that you are going to enjoy more benefit as a u.s paypal account owner so but if you are creating such accounts and you know that you will need so many criteria to overcome their verifications number one on the list is you have to have a u.s number number one then you know having a u.s number it does not mean we're going to all these you are number provider saying that you want them to help you out by getting that if you if you want to go for a us number go for a legit one that, and anyway if you want to get a legit one you have it have to be a paid one so <clears throat> you're getting a paid us account in an account you're not even sure whether it's going to let her be free by paypal because most of those things you have to get a us number have an ssn 
which is your social security number and all those things as a nigerian or as an african you getting all those things you know it's going to cost you more because you have to pass through so many jungles so many obstacles in order to create just one account come to think of it very tough and very hard so i always advise using an african-based account like example lesotho because we believe most of you guys are many are familiar with lesotho paypal accounts so even those that are also creating south african accounts i always advise lesotho is still my best when it comes to creation of foreign accounts i prefer lesotho very well because they have a benefit of you adding your nigerian postal code to the account for instance if you want to claim as a nigerian and you are creating an account with your nigerian national your nin this is your national identity number showing that you are from this country and the account you are creating is from another country how can you be able to prove to them that you just own a business there that you are not an indigenous? so the best thing i always say is create a lesotho account where you can even put in your nigerian poster address code because Nigeria has five postal address code, which your postal address number is only five for Nigeria. Now, let's also have that benefit for you to put in that five. And when you are creating an account and you put in that five, meaning you can still add more details, claiming you are still from Nigeria, but you just run a business there. And what come to think of it, if you are using a, US, a, a South African PayPal account, for instance, South African is only for space. You don't expect them to just agree you're using just for space and you are putting in the national NIN of Nigeria. So, you see, there are two complicating issues here. So, I always advise go for Lesotho. Lesotho is still, the best, is still the best, but I'm not assuring you that Lesotho, after creating a Lesotho account, that it can never be banned. It can always be banned. It depends on the way you use them and how you operate with it. So, as I've said, go for a Lesotho account that you can put in your Nigerian details properly without them wondering or thinking that you're a scammer or you want to defraud any of their members. So, that is my number one on the list. So, the number two is, whenever you are creating an account, try adding that country's account while creating. Let me break it down. Whenever you are creating a PayPal account, try adding that country which you are using to create the account. As a Nigerian, whenever I'm creating an account, I have to add my Nigerian address to it. And come to think of it, you know that I'm not creating a Nigerian PayPal account here, so I'm using a Lesotho account. So I need to add a Lesotho address to that account too while creating. And how can I do this? There are some platform that gives account generation yes, to generate an account. You can go on to there, ask them to give you, you can type in Lesotho address. Something like that. So they'll bring out different addresses which you can copy. And after copying them, I also advise after copying them, go to Google Map, put them in to know if they are still active. And if they are still active, that is the best of luck for you. You can you copy the, the number, the address they have given you in that platform. You copy it, go on to your paper while creating you add that address as your business address. There are some two there's two spaces which is given by paper, which is your business address and your home address. So you copy that list of address which you have copied from that platform you copy it down to your paypal as a business address so once you have created that and you know that your paypal is having a business address indicating that your business resides in lesotho or resides in south africa but your home address you can put in your nigerian address, address as that so that's the benefit of you having a lesotho account as i said lesotho is still the best because you put in your nigerian address and also put in their lesotho address so that's the benefit you'll be getting so i said in your business address you copy the lesotho address generated from that platform and you paste it as your business address that is for the lesotho that is your business address having that lesotho home address so in your own home address you can put in your nigerian home address as it is showing in your nin sorry please i want you guys to always know this the nin we should be putting in into your paper the address shown there should be what you also put in your home address you can later put in your nigerian number it's not bad put in your nigerian details they are not bad so just always understand that the address of the country you are using should always be in that account while creating it because people give privilege of adding two address so that is by the way the third of my point is here the third thing you should always note while creating a foreign address is whenever that address is being created successfully avoid frequent logging in yes most people don't understand this that people are always sensitive in terms they notice some frequent access of an account for instance you log in in the morning two minutes later you say you want to log in again to know whether something is going on you don't have to do all those things that's why paper have pay me link for instance if you know you are expecting some funds from someone that wants to pay you have your email address after you have linked in your email address to that account go and find you don't have any reason to be consistent be entering your accounts consecutively consistently to know whether someone send you money after that whenever your money enters your account you get the notification in your email so whatever whenever you get a notification in your email that is the only time you just have to log in to confirm 
It's not that you just have to keep on logging in. Avoid frequent logging in. That is another problem people are not getting. Avoid frequent logging in. Once you have created an account and you know that the account is free, that they have not started noticing anything, just quit logging in for the moment. So whenever you start receiving funds, you can now log in to check your phone. Once you receive fund, once you want to use it for any transaction, that is all. That is the third point. Avoid frequent logging in. And another thing which I also ask to ask you to do is always advise you while creating a PayPal account. Create a PayPal account using a visual business. Business that shows that it cannot be seen, it cannot be touched or carried. That means business that shows that they are digital products. For instance, you selling a software, software as I've said, a digital marketer, all those things that they, even if a money, a, a cash is sent to your phone, is sent to your PayPal account, it won't want other people start thinking that what is this money for? They believe you have made a business and you have made a sale, and the person that is buying from you has already downloaded it to their software or their app, to their mobile phone, or all those stuff. So make sure you just have a business showing that you are selling a digital goose but if you start using physical products you are going to go through more because they'll be asking for tracking ID to know whether the goose is being delivered and all those stuff we keep on delaying your fund so always and I always advise go on and use a virtual business meaning business that can be seen but cannot be touched that means business that are, that are not physical so those are what you should always do and that is just by the way that's my fourth point here my fourth point which is create an account indicating that you sell virtual goods which are digital products that is it whenever whenever you're creating an account so on my fifth point so this fifth point is very important and i always want people to always stick to this many people have been wondering now how can how can how can so this is why i'm going to mention this now whenever you finally create an account do not expect paypal to start sending you email of confirmation and the rest whenever you are done creating a paypal account instantly go ahead and link in your us bank account those that don't know how to link in the US bank account, I have a video which I'll also be posting in my description. So you can go ahead, watch that video in order to know how you can link a US bank account to your PayPal. Once your PayPal business US bank account is linked successfully, that's have warranted for that has given them a warranty that this account is legit. So instantly, after creating a, a PayPal account, go ahead and link in your US bank account to it. That is another that is just the perfect way to get and even if you want to create and verify your account on an instance that is what you should always go ahead and do please as i've said for you that don't know how to do it i'll still give a manual video of how you can do that but for now go to the description below i have a video that also teaches you how you can create a us account that you can link to your paper so those are what you should just watch and follow the guidelines link it up and if you notice that you can't link it up you can go to my you can go to the comment section below drop in your own problem so this is just how i'll be doing it so guys i believe the ones i've said should be what you should you should always follow follow these guidelines which i've mentioned in my points number one is the country specific number two is try adding that country's address to your paypal account as a business address number three avoid logging in frequently number four while creating the account make sure that you indicate you sell physical digital products not a physical product so number five always try linking your us bank account in every successful account you have created to avoid them start sending you mail or message that they want to confirm your that is they want to do this and want to do that so once you are done with all those things good and fine that account can perfectly go as far as you want without them sending you any mail to know whether you are still the person operating or not and avoid as i've said avoid frequent logging in because once you keep on logging in with a nigerian ip it's going to always indicate that this is a wrong entry and that's why i say once you have created stop logging in frequently whenever a message comes to you you monitor your message and monitor your account through your email so that is how you can always supersede that so guys i believe this idea which i've given to you is worth it and it's worth your time so you can always show me some love by clicking on the like button subscribing to my channel and helping this channel grow because this channel is a channel which i really dedicated myself to always post in vital information to be helpful for every online entrepreneur out there so please show some love by clicking on the like button subscribing on my channel and being the member of my community and if you have any issues with your paypal account or you have